Hello everybody, my name is Toby Chimp, it's lovely to have you here for another episode of The Council. In the last episode, we did a bit more sneaking around, found some clues, met some more characters, and we have another, a vision where uh, Greg and a guy that may be Lord Mortimer were discussing something, and then Napoleon walked in, a lot of secretive shit came on, and we were going to go over and check it out basically, but then freaking big boy George Washington shows up and he's like, ah... Oh, I'm not sure about this girl. She was apparently dead. Let me go like check out her room while she's not in there. Can you help me? I'm like, no, George, I'm not doing that. That's freaking disgusting. Why are you sneaking about someone's room for? Just freaking talk to them if you think they're they're dead or something. I'm not the man for this. And he's like, oh, well, I hope you don't need my help someday. Like, come on. Freaking, freaking George, man. So, uh, yeah, we let George down, whatever. And the objective is to spy on the men from our vision. I don't know where exactly we're supposed to be going to, to do that. Maybe, maybe the map. Oh, oh we get a cutscene. Louis, you're straying from your objective. Oh, thank you. Video game. I don't know which, what room I'm looking for, but is it this one? Is that my room? Uh, that's me. That's me. <laughs> I don't know where I want them to go, so I guess I'll just keep going until I find a room that uh, these two do. I guess Napoleon's room, maybe. Or just check every room I come by, and uh, I recognize this part of the oh. corridor. I'm close. Multiple paths. There are multiple paths to reach your objective. It may be a good idea to think twice before embarking on the first path you come to. Okie dokie. I gotta be honest. I don't really remember the vision. Is that Napoleon down there? So I don't remember exactly what room it was. Can I go downstairs? I cannot go downstairs. Can I get in this room? Oh, this is Elizabeth's room, right? Oh, not Elizabeth. Uh, Locked. Is this the room? Now I can pick a lock because I'm a freaking boss. Yeah. Shouldn't be too difficult. This is definitely a smart thing to do. I thought this was not Elizabeth. Uh, this doesn't seem to be the room for my vision. This is the girl's room, whatever her name was. I don't remember. Sorry, I've forgotten. It will come King to me. George the Third in coronation robes. Here we go. Nice touch for the room of an English duchess. The, du the duchess, the that's right. In Harlem. I find it a little hard to understand this painting choice. I hope she's not in here. <laughs> Dear E, oh. I received your last letter. Unfortunately, the Crown informed the Golden Order that our mission should, under no circumstances, hamper Sir Gregory's plans. Decidedly, they have support from the highest level in Buckingham Palace. So here we both are, hands and feet tied, and little room to maneuver. Keep me abreast of events. Our mission is becoming more complicated. Yours, E. I can hear yes. the French some female the breathing. Doesn't appear to know anything about the arrival of she our She might be sleeping, Sarah. maybe. I therefore cannot comment on it. However. My guess is that she has come here for personal reasons. Okay, so maybe this Duchess is Elizabeth. Maybe the other girl was Sarah. Hmm. Okay. There's definitely someone in here, though. She's in here. And I'm about to walk in after freaking... Ladies Waldegrave. Breaking Waldegrave. into her room. Painted upon the request of the Waldegrave family. This could be awkward. In an effort to find them a husband. What was this? Read it, definitely. It's a letter from Lady Hillsborough she apparently never got to send. Office 101. Buckingham Palace, London? Dear Mr. Walsingham, nothing to worry about. I cannot meet you at the palace as planned, as an important matter has cropped up, which requires all my attention. You will guess who I have gone to fetch at dear Mortimer's, and thus you will understand my hurried departure. What on earth is she talking about? Mm. I can guarantee you will be back as soon the as plot possible. Thickens. You will understand that to be able to serve you, I must assemble all my assets. No, you know she's, I put the interest she's got some assets, all right. My own. Tell the Queen I, of course, will assume all of the responsibility and consequences for my absence. Your devoted servant, E. H. I can't do it. Whoa, this looks serious. Well, at any rate, Emily didn't come here to finish up a deal with anyone. She came here looking. That was for annoying. Just like there were two I choices there that I couldn't do either of. Didn't have the points for it, or possibly the skills. Frustrating. All right. Uh, I thought it was Emily. What was the name? Oh, I'm so confused. 
Emily, Elizabeth, Sarah. Oh, she's totally. Oh, it's kind of awkward. I'm just gonna look around and steal some of your stuff, maybe. Ah, oh, I want to use the jelly quickly. It's Emily's room. Uh, she's fast asleep. This is kind of awkward and creepy. I'll go Emily's body. Move away from the. It's giving me the option. He's a sleazy guy. Okay, I'm just playing the character. I, I got to. I got to. Right. I know YouTube's gonna want to see what comes from this. Mm, <laughs> as beautiful by night as she is by day. Why is she wearing that to bed? Dude, you're getting a little bit too close, though. She's gonna wake up and it's gonna scare the crap out of me. Moose has gone quiet. Please don't wake up. All right. Well, that was creepy. Let me just uh, look for your objects. Is this freaking heavy rain? An origami. Is this a prequel? This origami talks about the disappearance of a child. It was the fat detective all along. Uh, pick, pick it up. Ah, oh, then she's getting no. She don't doesn't know it's me that's in that room though. Only borrowing it, of course. Yeah, of course. I'm playing the character, guys. He's an asshole. Right, and this isn't me. I'm not saying this is what I would do. I'm just saying I'm playing to the strengths of our character. A letter from William Pitt the Younger addressed to Emily. Yeah, Emily. He's the present Prime Minister of the United Kingdom. Who the fudge is Elizabeth then? Indeed, some powerful backers. Madam, thank you for consoling the Queen. The King's situation is worsening, but I wager he'll recover from this present fit. Next time you speak with Her Majesty the Queen, would you please be so kind as to ask her? To look into my petition to raise taxes with the king. I will personally see to it that our nation will recover from this impasse. But King George's mental situation is slowing down our decision taking. Thank you in advance for all your help. William Pitt, Prime Minister of the United Kingdom of Great Britain. Go on, Pitt. The Pittster. Oh. Two coils circle the lock. Oh, yeah? Can I use some jelly? Oh yeah, <laughs> yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Easy, and a letter. Take it. Dear Gregory, thank you for the information. I've managed to find out about the names you gave me. George Washington is a man you can trust. Okay. In spite of his obvious talent for politics, he has remained upright and honest. On the other hand, as you may well know, he is already doing business with Lord Mortimer. It will be more difficult to approach him. Napoleon Bonaparte was unknown to me until today. He's a passionate young French soldier for whom Mortimer predicts a promising future. Take heed. He is a man of conviction, which to my mind makes him potentially dangerous. As for Sarah de Richet, what more is there to say? You already know each other. She was apparently invited by Lord Mortimer about an ongoing matter in Paris that concerns a receiver in stolen art. See you soon. Mm. So that she's been contacting Gregory. Trust George. Doesn't know much about Napoleon. But he's a man of conviction. That might be a good clue for us. Alright, good to know, good to know. Got some Carmelite water. Still not sure what it what it does. Queen Charlotte. All the royal family of England is there from what I can tell. Wow. A letter from William Pitt the Elder addressed to Emily. He was the English Prime Minister. Let me just read this. this letter dates from 15 oh. years ago now. Oh, Madam. Oh, yeah, there we go. <laughs> I shall never thank you enough for all your care and attention. I shall be indebted to you until my last breath. If you have any request of me, you only need ask. With regards to my son William, I shall never thank you enough for looking after him. You know the latter's preferences, and you will understand he needs you desperately. For that, and as agreed with Queen Charlotte, our friend Duke Hillsborough will carry out his task and meet with you within six months. From then on, you'll be free from want. Yours sincerely, William Pitt, Count Man, of Chatham. I'm never going to remember all this. That's really bad. I'm hoping the game kind of remembers it for me <laughs> when I need it. Uh, I haven't got freaking vigilance. I'm going to use this as well. Just because. Ah, oh, that sucks. 
I could use jelly, but you know, I don't want to waste it. We gotta get out of here. Really, she doesn't wake up. When I leave, can I go out the balcony? Maybe. I can. How is this not waking her up? Do not slam the door. Oh! Because <laughs> that noise scared me. What are you doing? Oh! Sir, oh, I sweet. Understand your Smart! But the pressure on my family complicates the task. Relax, my friend. Your relatives will soon be huh. safe. Is that Lord Mortimer? So what I saw in my vision really did happen. Is that... Well, I hope I haven't missed anything important. I... Is that David Attenborough? So much. Richard Don't Attenborough? Now the, the one from Jurassic Park? Let us speak about your support. Yes. You mentioned earlier some assistance from the Golden Order? Absolutely. I have concluded an agreement with their leader, Lady Sarah Faustine de Richet. Another case that Mother didn't tell me about. Um, the funds come from on. the Order will finance the building of a foundry in Tuscany. You will soon be able to count on a hundred or more cannons for your future campaigns. I... Uh, I was not expecting so much help from you. Uh, when can I meet this uh, de Richet? Well, unfortunately, something has cropped up. De Richet has disappeared. This guy's Is shady here? as fuck. Here? <laughs> what? Here? Yes, but the staff are redoubling efforts to find her, I assure you. So the agreement Look at his is it on hairline. Off? It is on. Her right hand man has just arrived here to help us find her. And it is none other than her son, Louis Moras de Richet. I wager he will ensure his mother's commitments are met. Louis. Not an easy name to live with in these times. <laughs> of course. Yes, of course. But from now on you will deal with him. This man, it can only be more to more. It's too Very obvious. Well, I will seek him out. Oh my god. Man. It's just a bird. Have I got... A... Oh. Can I do something here? I feel like I should do, but it's not giving me anything. Oh, I've got the... Oh, I don't have agility. Shit. It's just a bird. A... Cool. Cool. I better get away from here. <laughs> I better get away from here. Let me just slink off into the distance. Look at that. Like a shadow in the night. No one suspects a thing when Louis around. I'm hoping this is our room. Consult your journal frequently. Alright, didn't want to read it anyway. This looks like our room, although they do kind of look the same. Ah! Jesus! Uh, Emily? Emily. Emily? I can explain. Perhaps, but remain still. Oh god, disconcerted. Someone threw you off balance. The cost of effort points increases when using your skills. I don't have any points. Use a golden elixir to cure yourself. Which one's the golden elixir? Gil. But, but first, oh, I did. you could perhaps remove the blade from my throat. Uh, you have ten seconds to explain your presence here. I don't know what I did. Um, I'm innocent. I'm innocent. Misleading. I'm, I'm only passing through. And the origami bird. I suppose it simply flew into the ah. Actually, I was just putting it back. Oh, don't push uh. luck. <laughs> what are you doing in my room? Alright, I can I can sandwich this. Ah, uh, what do I do? They're both like bad choices. <laughs> Louis, your childish games are too oh, my patience. crap. There's not much more I can say, really. Are you trying to There make isn't me much more I can say. You have been a great disappointment to me. Please leave now. I got a new trait at least. I got something from it. I'm sorry, Emily. There's a lot going on here. So now she suspects me. Now she hates me. George hates me. And then you got the Pope, man. The Pope is my bro. I know he's not the Pope. But I will refer to him as the Pope. Go back to bed. Was that how much of a failure this day was? <laughs> Alright. Fair enough. Fine. I still don't know which of these freaking items is uh, the elixir and which ones cures negative alterations. Okay. So I guess that's like when... So basically if you get caught off guard and your points are going to cost more, you can use one of those to make sure they cost the normal amount. So hopefully I don't have to use those too often. That one's pretty self-explanatory. So is that one. 
reveals them. I should have probably done that one, maybe. I don't know if that would have helped or not. Whoops! Not a good day for old uh, for old Louis. Oh. Pope, my man. What are you doing here? Give me some good noise. I good to news. To you about something important. Do you still have my letter? Yes, and I didn't open it. I you in the home? Why do you ask? I have a name to add to it. I don't want to lie to him. He's, he's my bro. Here it is. Thank you, my son. Ah, uh, I see that it still seems. Yes, of course. I was right to put my trust in you, Louise. Uh, give me one second, please. As long as you give it back to me. I can't imagine what would have happened if I hadn't added this name to the list. Please be sure to yes. give this letter to Sarah. I have his trust. You can count on it. Just gotta wait for the right time to stab him in the back. <laughs> See ya, Pope. Have a good night. I don't no idea what time it is right now. I guess it's still night time. Whatever. I'm exhausted. I better go to bed. Nah, I'll search my room tomorrow. If mother stayed here right before me, you never know. Oh. And Mortimer had better show That's up. That's a weird camera angle. Yeah, Mortimer, you better frickin' show up. Alright, so I need to search this room thoroughly tomorrow. That wasn't such a, a good one for me. I'll admit, yep. Yep. I could have helped Mr. Washington. I could have prevented a violent confrontation. I could have found out something about Mother's past. Not the best uh, quest for me, that one. I would admit. <laughs> but, you know, we're learning. We're learning. I've still got the Pope's trust, old Piaget. Uh, Emily kind of hates us. George hates us. But it's fine. Maybe level up. Yeah. Get some sweet points. What do I need here? Conviction. Convince people of the sheer force of your will and your attitude. Well, I have one in that. I think that might help with Napoleon. Do you by the sounds of it? Get some logic. Oh, I don't have that activated. How do I activate a skill? I don't... Um, I don't know. How do you activate a skill? Hmm. Maybe I have to go like... You have to get level 1 before it's activated? I don't really freaking know. I'm very confused. Uh... Pretty good in all these points right now. So maybe let's try and level something else up. Is there anything with two points in that I can... I only have ones I've already got. Oh, what's this? What is... Oh, because I got an extra point, didn't I? That's right. So now that's activated. I got etiquette. I got something. Conviction. Yeah, let's work on it. Sure. Sure. I could remove points. Ah, screw it, that'll do. <laughs> I'm playing this how I want. If I make mistakes, make mistakes. It's one of those games. There's no right or wrong, wrong way to play it, I guess. Back up to four effort points. It's good to know. Hopefully if I had some of that... Uh, thorn stuff that makes my... Next skill point use free? Maybe that's still effective? Right. I don't know. In my vision yesterday, I saw that Mother had this room before me. Yes. I better search the room. Who knows? Maybe she left me something behind. Maybe. I've got that key still that I don't think I've used yet. Oh god. Uh, my next reading. So is that is, does that mean I've got that now? Can I read more than one? I don't know. Maybe conviction? I guess I've just read that now and I just get that. So that's good. Sweet. Next quest. Alright, let's get searching. I'll probably search this place and then uh, that'll likely be it for this episode. I haven't even had time to unpack my cases. I haven't even had time to unpack my cases. Okay, I mean, I wanted to just open it. But that's fine. Last judgment. Last judgment. Why do I always get the most terrifying room? That's not, yeah. It's not really a nice painter to have in the room. Oh. Writing material. Mother, what have been writing? I can't freaking inspect it. I don't have vigilance. Oh, I hate it. I don't hate not having the right skills. 
There better be something here that I can do with the skills that I've got. Incredulity of St. Thomas. Why is Caravaggio representing St. Thomas putting his finger in the wound? Thomas looks on but doesn't touch. Mm. Interesting. Oh. Nothing. Nothing. It's just it's just a pillow. I slept on it all night. There's gotta be something in here. There's gotta be something here that I can find. Otherwise this is freaking pointless. Inferno by Dante. Yeah, we've seen that before. We've seen Abandoned that. Abandoned hope, all ye who enter here. Yeah, yeah. Lovely lectures Mortimer is giving to his guests. Very jolly. What is this? What is this? This looks important. We've got a little cutscene. Come on, Louis. Oh, we've got the key for it. We got this. Must be the trunk Mortimer was talking about. The key should open it. Open it. Open it. Focus free. I don't understand whilst. What's the difference? That's not going to cost me anything, so I guess let's be cool and lockpick it. <laughs> I don't understand the difference there. <laughs> Whatever. Mother, what have you left us? What is it? Looks like some no jelly. Effects of Sœur de Richer to be given to her son, Louis. I should probably take it. I should probably read it, maybe. Amber fragments. You just found an amber fragment. It is the guy from Jurassic Park. And there's a freaking mosquito in there. Each time you pick up four of them, you increase your maximum effort points by one. Oh. Cool. Review them in the imagery tab. I guess I shall do that. Where is the amber fragment? Uh, amber fragment. I, I, don't, I don't see it. I guess, oh, it's this. Okay. It's pretty self-explanatory. Saint Jerome. <laughs> Nothing else in there. That was it. Yet again, art with political. My objective is still to look Saint for clues. Mother, give me some. Give me a sign. Don't let me get stuck by this freaking chair. It's got to be something. Oh, look. Here we go. Markings on the floor. Uh, just a bit worn out. Well. Oh. I was hoping to find something leading Maybe to the passage. Maybe it is. Maybe you put a book in it, does it? Oh, this bookcase is well stocked. Oh, how odd. Oh, this book has been put back the wrong way round. Ah. I was expecting the, suit, the bookcase to spin a around. A voyage around the world. The travel log of the explorer, Louis Antoine de Bougainville. One of Mother's favorite books. What a coincidence. What a coincidence, huh? And I don't believe in coincidences. It's just too much. I don't know what's going on here, but if you felt threatened, I'll bet you'd leave a clue, wouldn't you, Mother? He's smart. He knows what's up. Found it. Oh, a faint sign of the order. So quickly, he found it. Mother, you undoubtedly must have hidden a clue in this book. I thought you just found the clue. Let's see if I can find anything else in this room. More. Ah, I hate it. <sighs> Why don't I have vigilance? I got to unlock next time. Super important. Not far from solving the puzzle, I must keep searching. That's super annoying. <laughs> All right, what else is in here? I don't know what else I can look at. I feel like I've seen everything. That's just Dante's Inferno, right? Inferno yeah. by Dante. Abandoned hope. Anything All outside? Here. I must have missed something. This is the same. A priest robe. Oh, cross. That's the Pope's room. It must be Piaggi's room. Not gonna find much in there, I don't think. Mother, show me a sign. Give me something. Oh, hello. Here's something will undermine my botanist appreciation for the local climate. Hmm. Hmm. Looks like a lemon. Oh. Let's recap. Okay. My mother was in this room. She was. I found a rare edition of her favorite book. You did. She must have left something behind. Like a lemon. She must have used the writing material. Yes. What if she used lemon juice instead? Well, actually, it was a lemon. <laughs> to hide messages. Ah, you genius, oh, Louis. Using invisible ink. I bet she used a lemon to leave a message. The old lemon now, trick. How do I reveal the message? Oh, I don't know that one. You have to work that one out yourself, man. Is that it? What's my new objective? Find something to reveal the hidden message. Okie dokie. I will do my best. Hope that it's in this room still. Maybe go around again. Maybe there's 
Maybe there's something I missed. I kind of want to end this episode off, but it just keeps throwing stuff at me. Oh, hello. Use the ashes. Assess the value of the ash. Yes, yeah, science, bitch. Apart from getting the book dirty, I can't see any use for this. Oh. Oh. Take that ash. I thought you were smart, dude. I thought you'd be like, if I use the ash on the paper, it could stick to where the ink was. Now I just blow the page, and it reveals the writing. That's what I would say. I mean, it's nothing. That's complete bollocks, but, you know. Sounds pretty cool. Look. Okay. Markings yeah. on the floor. Nothing new to say? Uh, just a bit worn out. I was hoping to find something leading to a secret Ready. passage. Ready thought. Oh, hello. Hello. Ah! It's so annoying! I can't get it! I want it! Oh, it seems like all the skills that I have points in come to no use. I've just got to believe that if I'd gone for a different route and chosen other skills, that the skills that I do have right now would also be just as annoyingly uh, unobtainable. Otherwise, I'm just going to tear my hair out. I'm going to anyway, but you know. Oh, use the wax. Take the candlestick. I really wish I could do any of these. I could do that if I had more. No, you know what? Screw it. Yes. Assess the value of the candlestick. Think about what it could be used for. Let's, let's assess the value. If a message is written in lemon juice, the flame will. Yes. Probably could have just taken the candlestick to begin with, but it's nice to be able to be smart for a little bit. You got this, Louie, I believe. Use use the ash somewhere as well. Anything else in here? Probably not. Hello. Got another coin. So we have one quick last check outside. Maybe there's another lemon or something. Another lemon-like... Oh, 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 oh. All these freaking collectibles, dude. Bossing it. Another coin. I'm rich. Freaking rich. This room looks unoccupied. Really? So let's go in. This room looks unoccupied. Guess not. Bottle of wine here. Does that mean anything to you, Louis? Oh. Ah, there's nothing I can do here. That's so annoying. <sighs> Wait, what is this? Oh, it's just a look. Okay. All right, honey. The really yes, the gods. got the jelly and some water. Getting stocked up. It's good. It's good. I'm liking it. All right, that's uh, that's it, right? I'm sure, I can just go back to the the desk, maybe. That's what I'm hoping. Please. Here we go. Take the ink. Could have used points, but uh, you know, whatever. Maybe go back to the book now. I don't know. I'm hoping this is the thing to do. What was that? Inferno. I'm sure about Inferno by Dante. I don't care. All ye who enter here. I don't care. Lovely lectures, Mortimer's. Maybe there's more guests. stuff to reveal, but Very I feel jolly. like I've looked at most things. Look at the chandelier, right? Nope, just looks kind of fancy. Let's do this. You got this, Louis, I believe. Don't tell me there's more to find here. Oh, God. It said ashes would ruin it, annoyingly. So pour some ink. I don't want to ruin this book, man. No, use the candlestick. He said the flame should show... Oh, God, I don't remember what he said. Maybe I should go back and read. Hold on. I don't want to screw this up. Candlestick. Ah, oh, there's no freaking. Uh, I don't know the freaking. Uh, wait, hold on, hold on, hold, hold on. What did they just say there for ash? Ash is used to reveal my mother's message. But you said it would ruin the. Okay, I'm gonna screw up here. Obviously. He said the flame would reveal the ink. Aha! It's working! Yes! 
heat reveals a message. Yes. I didn't Something screw up. My mother wrote. What up, Mum? Where all eyes size you up, you must pass by the Gorgon. I did it. Gorgon was the name of Medusa in Greek mythology. It's a snake woman. On the other hand, where all eyes size you up, I don't get it. And judging by the number of paintings in the manor, could be anywhere. After that, she adds, beware hero. The beast always charges the best protected soldier. And that's its weakness. What is my mother trying to tell me? If you've gone to so much trouble, you must not have only found something important, but you must have also felt like you were in great danger. I feel like we're about to get spooked here. Now I better hurry and find that damn Medusa. Oh, I knew someone was going to be there. Dinner is served in the Red Salon. Thank you, Gregory. Typical. I'm not hungry. Please give my apologies to all the guests. Uh, Sir Holm requests your presence, sir. Oh, that's not well, Gregory. It's a servant. I'm just going to have to wait before going and looking for my Medusa. Oh, Tell him I'll be there fine. Event. I guess I'll eat. Ugh. Ugh. <laughs> uh, what was that trait? How do traits even work? I don't. I honestly don't know. That's one thing I've not really looked at. Uh, okay. <laughs> Shady. <laughs> uh, oh, that's actually really bad. I thought it was like a good trait, but it just means manipulation costs one more effort point. That sucks. I'm guessing these are all... Good things. Oh man. So much emphasis on not screwing up. Uh, I'm going to leave it there. I assume that it's just saved. Hopefully it has. But I think that will do for this session of uh, the camp. So I've really enjoyed it so far. Hence why I've recorded three episodes in a row. Hopefully you're enjoying it as well. Hopefully you're, you're kind of thinking along with me. I'm sure you're screaming at the screen saying, You idiot, Toby. You're so stupid. Why don't you just smother ashes on the book? That would have been much better. But uh, unfortunately, I can't hear you because this is now in the past. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this series. I'm enjoying the game. And thank you for watching. If you would like, you can click either of these two videos to watch more content than mine. Or you can click the circular button to subscribe. And I'll see you next time. Take care, guys. Bye-bye.